been watching A Very British Scandal, which is the second season of BBC's anthology series that started with the 2018 very critically acclaimed A Very English Scandal. So this time round, it's the story of the Duke and Duchess of Argyle, whose brutal divorce made headlines in the 60s and Many of those headlines in the British press were deeply misogynistic and would drag the Duchess's name through the mud. She was kind of just slut shamed through the whole thing. As the Duchess, Margaret Campbell, who was a very popular, very beautiful socialite, we have the Crown's Claire Foy, and she is amazing, as usual. And then as the Duke, we have WandaVision star Paul Bettany. All eyes on you, famous Mrs. Sweeney. Captain Ian Campbell. I know who you are. Be my duchess. Yes. I really loved the series. I think Bethany and Foy do a really good job at like portraying their roles. I think the Duke, that performance, he makes it really believable how he's so charming at the beginning and it quickly turns sinister. Claire Foy as well does a really good job at playing Margaret with, with dignity and putting on screen that, that pain that she went through when she was kind of having her private life pulled to shreds by this vicious press and her husband. So the series is just a three-part season, which means that there's no extraneous material. It doesn't sag in parts, it's very tight, but it does feel comprehensive and it never feels rushed, which I think is a really big credit to this since it like spanned many years. The first season was written by Doctor Who legend Russell T Davies. This time around, the reins are handed over to Sarah Phelps. So Phelps has previous credits on the BBC 2019 drama Dublin Murders, and she also did last year's adaptation of Agatha Christie's novel The Pale Horse. And in an interview, she actually spoke about how when she read about Margaret's story, she made a very British scandal like as a tribute to her. And I feel like that aim really comes through as an audience. We kind of bear witness to these double standards and the deep misogyny that kind of ran through that whole case and kind of the legacy that it still has today. So overall, would you say that it is a binge or a bin. It's a binge. He doesn't care about affairs. The only thing he cares about is destroying me. 